Hey guys, what's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to Vinel TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing and we appreciate it. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. We got this gear. This baby right here is HP Office Jet 8025P. This printer is multifunctional printer. It's multi-tax, four in one if you like. In the sense you can copy, scan, print, and fast from this gear. This printer is with ADF, automatic document feeder. This printer is for office use, for businesses, for students. Basically, I'm going to give you an overview of this printer. Then for us to install the ink cartridges. This printer is using ink cartridges 912, 912. At the back here, from the back, we have the power cable. Three pin power cable is included in the packaging. Just above the power cable, you have the USB cable spot. Unfortunately, the USB cable is not included in the packaging. I'm going to show you what it looks like. This is the USB cable. We have this at Vinet Tech Store, free delivery here in UK. And it goes in here, Stick it inside and this flat end goes to the back of your PC. Once it's inside the back of your PC, download the software, download HP Smart App and connect this printer via USB cable. But these days, they expect you to connect this printer via Wi-Fi network. Okay, this is just by the way. Now, just above the USB cable, you have the two spots here is for a telephone line or broadband so that you can fast with this printer okay serial number for this printer is right here at the back this is the serial number for this printer in case if you need to contact hp office or hp smart hp support now i'm going to turn this printer around okay this is the adf the benefit of adf is you scan and copy multiple pages of documents in one go okay here is the scanner flat bell scanner load particular document you want to copy or scan id card select the function from the lcd screen and they will do the job i'm going to lift up this printer once you lift it up the end cartridges holder is right here okay once you open it up the end cartridges holder will come right in the middle for you to change it it does this automatically by the way if you have any paper jam any issue with paper open up this section check for any paper jam and debris at the back here if you can't find anything just gently close it okay close the printer down close it this way lift up okay the other thing you can do is open it up this section okay and bring out the paper thread you can also open up this section and take and check for any paper jam and debris so you can check for any paper jam and debris right here as well okay and gently close it okay now i'm going to bring, close this printer down now i want to show you this is the button casket the paper button paper thread so you load various sizes of paper right here okay so you just need to adjust it to extend this you just need to extend this this way okay so you just need to press here to extend it okay if you want to have this completely inside just press down so this is how to open up this paper tray okay so right now i'm going to now if you want to close this you just need to make sure or bring it out you need to press the button here okay the two side press it down for you to be able to close the printer Okay, it's in now if you want to switch this printer on and off this is the on and off button you can see this light that is flashing here signify that this printer is not yet connected to Wi-Fi network once it's connected it will be a steady blue light now what I want to show you is basically in terms of the function like I mentioned earlier you can print copy scan and fast from this gear this printer got printing speed of 120 print per minute for black and 10 print 
for color with the paper tray you can load up to 250 sheets of paper right here okay you can load up to 250 sheets of paper and uh, likewise you have three years warranty like this printer like i mentioned is using ink cartridges 912 and to load the ink cartridges just need to open up this section lift this printer up okay the ink cartridges holder is right there in the middle for you to change it now what we need to do is to do this we need to For us to load the ink, you just need to start from the red color, okay? So do this one after the other. So do the red, red color followed by blue, yellow, and black, okay? So right now, so we need to go with the red color, okay? You hear a click sound. Now followed by blue color. Okay. Blue color, just go in. So we just need to go in the blue color. Here I click sand to blue. The next is yellow. Okay, go in with the yellow color. Go in, okay, with yellow. Okay, now the last but not the least. In, okay, so. Okay, and it's in. Now I'm going to bring the camera close for you to see. So this is how to you can see. Once you load everything correct, you can see red, blue, yellow, and black. Okay, and once you make sure everything is done, just gently close it. Okay, close it. Now it's checking the printer. What is doing right now is checking the printer. Please wait. Here we go. HP new HP cartridges, the new HP ink cartridges installed. Click OK. You can see that once you're done, click OK. It will tell you that everything is done. Okay. So this is how to load the ink cartridges for this printer. Right now, I'm going to show you on my next video how to Connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. Thank you and stay blessed. Thank you.